We give God some praise. Amen. He's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Thank you to our moderator. Praise God. Greetings in the wonderful name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Our soon coming King. There might be aches in your body, but it's time to praise Him. You might have a headache, but it's time to praise Him. You might not feel like people praising Him, but it's time to praise Him. Praise God. God is a good God. Hallelujah. The song says, every time I think about Jesus, I feel good. Hallelujah. Praise God. My God delivers again. Yes, my God delivers again. Just when things look hopeless, Yes, he reaches down where well, his hands well, they go the poor seeds of evil who have to flee at his command. Hallelujah, oh, just when things look hopeless. Jacob is a deliverer. 
He's a healer. Glory to God. He delivers again. Praise God. The song so early, how beautiful heaven must be. Sweet home of the happy and free. Not the sad, but the happy and free. Thank God we're in line to inherit the happy and free. Thank God we're in line to see how beautiful heaven must be. Oh, hallelujah. Give God some praise. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Praise God. It breathed the scripture read this morning about the man of that Seda. The man had an issue. Praise God. Praise God. He said, in these, praise God. John chapter 5 and verse 2. And there at Jerusalem, by the sheep market, a pool, which is called in Hebrew, tongue, Bethsaida, having five portions. In these lay a great multitude of impotent folks, of blind hearts withered, waiting for the moving of the water. You have to understand the water is here, yes. The porch is there, yes. But not until there's a moving before deliverance will come. Not until there's a moving in the water for healing to come. Not until there's a moving for freedom to come. So even though they were sick, they were lame, and they need healing, but not until the angel of God moved the water, mess it up, worse for my 19 years, before it could be effective. Hallelujah. In these days, there are a great multitude, he said, of impotent folks, of blind, and we don't know when you're blind, you cannot see. Hard, withered. They were waiting for the moving of the water. Because when the water start move, that's when something happened. When the water start move, that's when they will get healing. When the water start to move, that's when the anointing of God will flow. What is your impotency today? What is your issue today? Are you by the pool waiting for some healing? Are you by the poolside? The Lord is reminding you that the Lord delivers again. You might be by your Red Sea, but the Son said the God of Abraham will deliver you. Praise God. Verse 4 says, For an angel went down at a certain season. They don't know the season. But one thing I know they were waiting. The Son said, Waiting down here by the river when you come, Lord Jesus. The enemy don't want me to cross, but I'm a waiter. I'm a waiter until my changes come. Amen. Keep waiting. You don't know when the steering of the water is coming. You don't know when the pool is going to be steered by the angel. But if you're waiting by the river, hallelujah. What comes your next in line? For a blessing. For the angel. Verse 4, went down at a certain season into the pool, not on top of the pool, not walking around the pool, but the Bible said he went into the pool and he trapped the water. If you remember when you get baptized, they sing the old song, the water is trouble, my friend, not to walk around, not to look at it. But the son says, step right in. Not until you step in before you feel something. Not until you step in the water. Before your deliverance come. Before the new man come. Before the old man is washed away. Amen. Oh God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. in the waves. And that was in the middle of the water. Paddling a little bit. And you saw the, the wave coming from yonder towards where you are. But because I cannot swim, I run for my life. Because the water is trouble. It's no more smooth. And it's only if you want to be able to swim good. And you can't swim. You're saying that. Oh, God. 
glory to God. <clears throat> I trouble the water. Whosoever then first after the troubling of the water stepped in was made whole. We're talking about next in line. Amen. This man of an issue. He can't move fast. He has an infirmity. He can't run fast. He's in the area where many people are. But only one will be able to set free. So every time you're about to jump in, somebody go ahead of him. Every time you're about to get your freedom, somebody step before you. Every time you're about to get your deliverance, somebody get it. But you wait, wait till your tears come. It might take longer, but it will come. 38 years is enough for you and I to say, I give up. 38 years is a long time. And if somebody is 38 years old, that person past teenage, teenager area, past young adults, <clears throat> and going into pretty soon will be a senior citizen next few years. So for this man to be waiting 38 years, and that's in addition to his age, in addition to all, all he was, that means he's an elderly man. But what, what I like about this man is that he never give up. He went the first year after 10 years, he said, I'm not giving up. In Jamaica, I was saying, no, I give up. Me I hold on until Jesus come true for me. 38 years. And every time he tried to get a healing, somebody beat him to it. But it comes a day when Jesus, the song said, when Jesus passed by, the tempter's power will be broken. When Jesus passed by, all tears are wiped away. This man waited, and he waited, and it looks like there will be no healing. It looks like there will be no deliverance. But then one blessed day, the unexpected happened. 38 years when he was waiting, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob, Deacon, passed by his way. And when Jesus looked, he realized that this man need help. And every time he tried to go in, somebody bounced him off. God of a set time to deliver. God of a set time to heal you of the high blood pressure. God of a set time to heal you of the diabetes. God of a set time to heal you of your pain, your heartaches. But just wait. They that wait upon the Lord. Yes, you have tears, you have sadness, but weeping only endure for a night. But the joy of the Lord will come in the morning. Give God some praise. Will come in the morning. Hallelujah. And a certain man, verse 5, there which had an infirmity, 30 and 8 years. My God, that's a long time. Many of us can't even remember when we went to the supermarket.